the inscription is open for Phase 3 of NASA's 3D Printed Habitat Challenge, which looks for ways to create shelters for astronauts in places like the Moon and Mars. The $2 million prize for this phase encourages competitors to create miniature habitats using indigenous materials from where the habitat is built. An example of this would be the lunar regolith, or soil for a habitat on the Moon. There are five levels of competence. The vision is that someday the autonomous machines will be deployed on the Moon, on Mars or beyond to build shelters for the human habitation, NASA officials said in a statement. On Earth, these same capabilities could be used to produce affordable housing where necessary, or where access to conventional building materials and skills is limited. The ideas and technologies that this competition has already produced are encouraging, and we are excited to see what this next phase will bring. Monsi Roman, program manager of NASA's Centennial Challenges, said in the statement. The solutions we seek in our competitions are revolutionary, which by their nature makes them extremely difficult. But this only encourages our teams to work harder to innovate and solve. The competition is conducted as a partnership between NASA and Bradley University and includes sponsors Caterpillar Incorporated.